Hi there, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. So on this video, I'm gonna teach you how to find top 5 best utility bots for Discord. And right now, I'm currently inside a website called Sapphire. And basically, this is one of the bots I'm gonna give you. And the reason for that is, for beginners, especially for creating your server in Discord, and you're looking to add some bots. Utility bots is the top one recommendation and type of bots you want to add. And on top of the list of the bots I'm going to give you, this is going to be Sapphire. Reason to that is, as you can see right here, it is completely free. Trust me, I've been on the Discord business. i have using Discord since as far as I can remember. There are only limited utility bots that are completely free. Some are free, and then they're going to be paid subscriptions. But this is completely free. So let's check it out. I'm going to click on Add to Discord. So with this one, I'm just going to choose a server that I want to add that Sapphire with. I'm going to have that one, a personal server. And by the way, guys, if you're not familiar on how to create your personal server, I have a video about that. So please check it out. I'm just finished this caption. I'll see you once inside. So welcome back to the video. Right now, this is what's inside Sapphire. And as you can see right here, it's going to be welcoming your server. Basically, if you have your server name on this part right here, it will show up. If you name your server, for example, sample server, it will name welcome sample server here. Now with this one, you're going to check on the left section, the different things that you want to know. But before we get into it, I want to show you that there is an option here to go premium. Now I know I said this is completely free, right? But the only difference regarding the premium here, the paid subscription is the custom brand. Because if you click on custom branding right here, you can edit your exact bot. What I mean by that is, everything here is totally free. However, if you want to edit your personal bot and say it's yours, that is the part where you need to pay. For example, the mini, this is going to be paid £5 per month. Small for $8, 12 and 15 Those are going to be the plans. Other than this, everything is going to be completely free. As you can see right here, the top one option that shows you is going to be customizable. Other than that, every feature is available. So going back to general settings. You're going to see here the different permissions you can check. The commands are right here. So I'm just going to let you know or I'm going to browse you on what to expect here. You can auto-moderate here. Of course, the most important part in bots is roles. You can join your roles here basically inside the dashboard of Sapphire. So you don't have to go back on Discord and fix the roles there. Go to settings and just do a lot of work. You can do it directly in the server or the Sapphire website. Of course, you can enter your welcome message here. You can change your reaction roles. Of course, for logging in or onboarding. And by the way, I have a video regarding onboarding in Discord. So please check it out. And that is why I love Sapphire so much. All of this are completely free. And you can enable and edit them inside the platform itself. And you don't have to go back on Discord and do a lot of things. I prefer doing it in the website itself rather than Discord anyway. But don't let that stop you. If you want to go to Discord, please do so. So next one on the list is going to be Probot. Probot is not entirely free as like Sapphire, but the majority of the features here are going to be completely free. So before we get started, I want to show you how much you need to pay regarding the premium feature of Probot. So for the Probot premium feature, you can pay $5 per month. That will be including advanced protection, more variables, urban everyone, execution and logs. And basically with that being said, the only difference regarding the premium and the free trial would be protection. That is the most thing that I can see here. Let's go back on the dashboard. So to enter Probot on your Discord server, of course, click on Add to Discord. Basically, we're just going to enable Probot to be added on our Discord server. Same goes as the one I did on Sapphire. So I'll, I'm going to see you once inside. So once inside Probot, you should see like this. By the way, guys, you're going to have an option to change your personal servers where you can add Probot as well. But right now, I only have it added on my personal tutorial box server. And the best part about this one that I see is leveling rules or leveling system. It has it inside its own dashboard. Same goes with Sapphire. You don't have to go back on Discord, much like this one right here. Let me just minimize it. And then let me just open my tutorial box server. It'll be around here somewhere. I think I'm currently on it. Anyway, as you can see right here, we have Probot added. And what I love about Probot so much is that, as you can see right here, you don't have to go to settings. Like I'm doing right now, for example, I can go to server settings and edit some stuff here. You can go and edit it directly on the website itself. 
same as Sapphire. And by the way, just wanna let you know that leveling system, I have a video about this also. Accor according with the onboarding, same goes with leveling, so please check it out. Also, another thing to take note of about ProBot is that it has a new feature. Yes, I said Discord, but you can also add it to Twitch. This is fairly new. Of course, after the pros that I've told you, I'm gonna tell you one con only that I can see in ProBot. If you go here on the reaction rolls, it should be around here somewhere. So of course, after the pros that I told you about ProBot, there is only one cons that I see here, and it's gonna be self-assignable roles. What I mean by this one is that you cannot really assign it inside the website itself. What you need to do is create an embed, and basically right here, this is only available for better version. And basically with that one, that means you need to go for the premium version as well. And that is actually a huge con for me, because I really like editing inside the platform itself. So I can just open my Discord and directly have fun. And now third of the list would be Koya. Now, I'm going to tell you right now the major con for this one. This is mainly anime theme. If you're not a fan of anime, this is a no-go for you. And as you can see on the website, there are a lot of ads. It might seem not possible or a scam, I know, but it is not a scam, trust me. You can directly add it to Discord by that server right there. Same process, choose the server that you want to add it up, click on continue, and click on authorize. I'm gonna see you once inside. So this is gonna be the inside of Koya server, and I can still see some ads. That is actually not a good thing for me. And next thing, before we get continue, this is gonna be premium. There is gonna be a one-time payment of $5.5 pounds or $4.99, this is only built once. Monthly is gonna be also $4.99, which is actually a bit confusing. Comparison for the pre plan and the premium plan is gonna be this guys right here. And basically, it not, it's not. And basically, it's not the same thing as Sapphire and Probot, because there are a lot of things that are not included in the pre plan as well. But other than that, it's still a good bot to go through, especially if you're a fan with anime. Also, you can adjust messages inside the website itself so that's a good thing for me if i click on join message right here click on it right there you can enter any welcome message you want you can still do it right here you can change the logo for example you can customize your commands there the auto mod is right here of course the auto roles are right here which is actually a good thing this is the cons that's missing in probot which is actually here in um koya so another thing that's actually good inside Koya is that it has a block phishing content. For example, it's basically security inside your Koya server, an additional security inside your server. Now you're missing a lot in Koya, but there are things that actually are not inside Sapphire or Probot, much like this one, the block phishing content, or basically security. Of course, we can forget about message builder. You can do it right here, on the website itself. Let's move on with the fourth one. Now next on the list would be Makai or Maki. Please correct me if I'm wrong, but I think it's Makai. Now, before we get inside it, I want to show you the best things that I love about Makai. First thing, we have the awards membership for being active. We have a music option. And there is this thing that is built in monetary currency inside your server, which is actually not inside um, Probot and Sapphire. Of course, you can also easily manage the roles in your server, make community interact easier, and so much more. Now, with that being said, let's try adding it on our Discord. And this is going to be what's inside Makai. And by the way guys, if you don't like the light version, of course you can go dark right there. Just simply click on that one, and now it's dark. And one thing I like about this one so much is the user interface. It is directly divided into first sections, for example, the welcome message, moderation, logs, tickets, and so much more. I wish other servers, especially Sapphire, since it's completely free right there, I wish they change it on this kinds of user interface, wherein it's pretty organized. And now, the things I like about that one is going to be engagement and fun. So these things right here are not found in any other bots from earlier, especially this economy. So you can play games and buy things with your server currency. It's like having your own currency inside your server. Of course, we have music as well. I think most of them has, but this is also a plus one for me. But the thing that I don't like about Makai is going to be embeds. This is only available for the premium version. Especially embeds are pretty useful and important in servers and roles. For Makai, it only gives you zero. Not unlike Sapphire Pro, but at least those guys right there, it gives you at least one, right? For Makai, you don't have any embeds free trial versions. So next con that I see here inside Makai would be reaction. 
as you can see right here it says enable right but the con with this one is you cannot really create it on the website itself you need to have a preset of embed and something where it embed are not free here it's like a loophole wherein basically you need to pay the per premium speaking of premium let's check the pricing with it so the free plan offers you access for over 16 modules and the premium is seven dollars per month of optimizer premium is twelve dollars per month basically with this one even though you're paying for the premium seven dollars you cannot really customize your app which is actually a very bad thing for me if i want to pay something i want all the features available but if you want the full access of course go for twelve dollars but i wish though they already gave me this one even though they removed some of this at least i can customize my own app i'm already paying right and let's move on with the next one and of course last but not especially not the least would be dino if you're using servers or discord servers for a very long time i'm pretty sure you've heard about dino dino is used over 9.4 million servers as of now we invite you to try it and hope you enjoy it right now with this one dino offers a wider range of features let's try doing it right now i'm gonna add to server so these are gonna be the premium plans for the standard we have five or six dollars per month 7.99 for the premium and custom would be that one so welcome back to the video right now this is gonna be the inside of dino remember what i said about makai dino has it also as you can see right here they're regularly um separated or organized properly especially the reminders the moderation the voice texting the other walls are right here everything is good and what i love about dino so much is it knows how to balance the free features versus the premium features so you're still getting a little bit good features if i'm gonna say regarding the free trial now let's check about the reaction roles here i'm gonna click on settings right there and unlike any other of the two from earlier you know makai and um robot you cannot really create messages or reactions in dino you can create up to three with or without a template or an embed awesome right you can also create an embed message here directly on the website of course you can do reactions button or drop downs you can do it here but only with a limit of three if you're using the free trial so other than that other than that con regarding the limit on the reaction messages i really don't have anything against dino it's a really good solid server we just go back in it right there so basically that's it so please check it out i suggest sapphire and dino if you're really into server modding or server roles again thank you so much for watching please hit the like button subscribe i'll catch you guys in the next one Goodbye for now.